Well, OpenAI has launched a new AI model and desktop version of ChatGPT along with an updated user interface. It's OpenAI's latest effort to expand the use of its popular chatbot. The update makes GPT-4 available to everyone, including OpenAI's free users. And technology chief Mira Marathi mentioned in a live stream event yesterday that the new model, called ChatGPT-4.0, is much faster and has improved capabilities in text, audio, and video. OpenAI also mentioned plans to allow users to eventually video chat with ChatGPT, but you really have to see it to believe it. Take a look. Hey, how's it going? Hey, Rocky. I'm doing great. How about you? I'm awesome. Listen, I got some huge news. Oh, do tell. I'm all ears. Well, in a few minutes, I'm going to be interviewing at OpenAI. Have you heard of them? OpenAI? Huh? Sounds vaguely familiar. <laughs> Kidding, of course. <laughs> That's incredible, Rocky. What kind of interview? Well, it's for a software engineering role, but I just need to know, do I look presentable, professional? Well, Rocky, <laughs> you definitely have the I've been coding all night look down, which could actually work in your favor. Maybe just run a hand through your hair or lean into the mad genius vibe. So it is more and more, uh, Dave, like a, a real person every day. We didn't see, obviously, its version, uh, you know, of a human speaking back. Uh, but certainly interesting can read your emotions and even guide you through emotional strife. I'm terrified. Do you like, I mean, this is an incredible technological advancement. <laughs> there are billions of dollars to be made here in investors. As a human being, as a father, as a citizen, I'm terrified. Right. Our children already struggle with face-to-face -face interactions. They spend most of their time on these devices, which I am guilty. But this just makes me think we're all going to shut in. We're all going to be more closed doors instead of getting out, talking face to face. Right. Again, incredible technological advancement. Does it scare you at all or is this just me? I'm not going to download it. I don't find that I have a need to download it right now. We've talked about meditation a bit. I do use a meditation app called Headspace. And I saw, actually, since the onset of ChatGPT, they have cut the annual membership for Headspace in half because something like a ChatGPT can sing you a lullaby at night. It can walk you through how to use you breath work to kidding. calm down, all sorts of things like that. Now, we've done many reports that not all the information is accurate, you know, so you have to fact yeah. check that yourself. Yeah. There's that. Um, but the, the use cases are very applicable. I may have to try an AI-generated meditation. <laughs> There's also a function that is a so-called Be My Eyes accessibility. Watch this. Is the king in residence at the moment? Yes. It looks like the king is in residence right now. The royal standard flag is flying above Buckingham Palace, which is the signal that the monarch is present. How exciting to be there while the king is home. Try and tell me exactly what they're doing right now, please. Um, right now the ducks are gently gliding across the water. They're moving in a fairly relaxed manner, not in a hurry. Occasionally, one of them will dip its head under the water, probably looking for food, and then pop back up. Okay, the ducks part, let me just set that aside. The initial part of that makes me feel actually a little bit better about this technology, that you can learn when you are out and about right. you can get some information some historical context about the things you are seeing out of your home so maybe a mixed bag I, I can't help but wonder just how many jobs professions millions of jobs worldwide are going to be impacted because yeah. this thing is moving at the speed of light right speed of sound the, the developments just come so fast every day. Right, right. And so that's what this update's all about, right? Much faster, more comprehensive. But again, you want to fact check the things that you see. I mean, that guy looked like Secret Service. What you used to see in an earpiece, he's like, tell me what's exactly going on right in front of me, uh, which is informative, uh, but also weird if everyone starts doing that outside. Yeah, right. Everyone's going to be bumping into each other as they talk to their <laughs> devices. Interesting stuff. Let us know what you think.